CRU has intercepted the message that there will be a terrorist attack here tonight. Gentlemen, what do we know? We are detecting three unidentified transports bound to dock at the city's port in five minutes. You sure it's not the space elevator that after? We have a cooler squadron in Bangkok too. Give them a call. Something, isn't it? Okay, come with me. With three ships to intercept. A cool of two reporting in. A cool of four. Standing by. A cool of five, all green. We are ready. A cool of three. You are my wingman. Watch my six. Battle friends have intercepted all cargo ships. Polka team, start the boarding procedure. Military transport plane at runway 5, state your service and intention. Okay, Irel here. We sent no one to the civilian airport. What's that? The airport. Tanks! They're firing at the terminal. Okay, Irel to battle friends squadrons. Take care of those tanks in civilian airport. Do not let them harm the civilians. Enemy riflemen in the terminal. Send the dispatch not Alpha Team. We are declaring state of emergency. Bangkok 2 is a no-fly zone. I repeat, Bangkok 2 is a no-fly zone. Passengers, please remain calm. Please follow security officers' advice and evacuate to a safe area. New Don Mayor International Airport to all inbound flights that's going Heads up! 
enemy force is destroyed. All clear. So many lives we lost today. This is too cruel. The Americans will pay, my comrade. They will pay. NORAD HQ to Orbital Elevator Defense Command. We detect hundreds of bogeys heading your way. Please verify. That's very funny, NORAD. Hey. Let me see that. What the? They must be doing an orbital drop. The only possibility is that they made it in when we turned off the orbital defense grid during the fight with the Patriot. You gotta be kidding me. The orbital defense grid was only offline for about 10 minutes. This cannot be just mere coincidence. All units be advised we're detecting a terrorist attack. No, this is a Spetsnaz strike force comprised of motherships, support ships, and battle frames. Give me information about our force in the combat area. We have Seventh Fleet Special Operation Battle Frame Squadron, call sign Skull. And? That's all we have. Skull One, wake up. AWAC Dragon's Eye here. Anyone here? Mobius, reporting in. Nemo ready. Rena, information. Your job is to defend the orbital elevator from the attack. The enemy will come from multiple directions, so watch your radar frequently and don't leave too much distance between you and the elevator. General, you think we'll be back by lunch? Somebody shut him up. Keep focus, don't get lost, and don't get yourself killed. That's all you need to accomplish this. All oh, right, you're using a brand new M5 Viper. It can change to flight mode and has a laser sword, too. You can thank me later. M5's flight mode will allow you to travel long distances without having to use boosters. Try it. As for the battle frame mode, I think you guys are already used to it. You can switch between battle frame mode and flight mode at any time.
Hey, Nemo, you don't feel like talking? Um, say the silence type. Oh, I get it. So he and Skull One can be best friends, huh? Another Kirov class ship. Kirov class destroyer. Its anti missile system is very strong. Maybe try blading it. It's gonna be really risky though.
Ladies, gentlemen, well done. So, how's the new model? Like it? It's kind of tough to pilot, boss. Emergency. The Americans are sending a strike fleet into our homeland. They're coming through the Bering Strait. We have small friendly fleet defending the area, but without reinforcements, they're going to be overwhelmed. You are to scramble to the combat area immediately. Lieutenant Juliana will help defend the friendly fleet from enemy attack, and Colonel Andy will penetrate into the center of enemy fleet with overbooster and destroy the fleet's flagship and her escort. All right, Lieutenant. You're going to use the new prototype battle frame. We designed this machine from scratch specifically for you. Reinforcement. What did they send us? Lieutenant Yuliana Alexandrov, ZX-05 Zaftra, arrived at the combat area. The defending fleet comprised of only one Kirov-class destroyer, two frigates, and several corvettes. The enemy will throw everything they have at us. Stay strong. You will only have to repel the front line. You won't be long before Colonel Ende obliterate enemy's fleet. Mission acknowledged. Protect the defending fleet and engage with the enemy's front line. We will be depending on you for the speed of this mission. It will be tough. We expect great things. Your the enemy's got high performance, no model battle frames out there. Moment. Be careful. Yes, sir. This is Captain of Admiral Zmeyevich, the flagship of the Fenring Fleet. We appreciate all support. Don't worry, Juliana. I believe in you. We'll bring results. Everything will be fine. Yes, sir. Jinhai, Efim, Anna, you join Lieutenant Juliana's formation. Keep yourselves close to her if you want to stay alive. Jinhai here. Roger. Lieutenant Juliana, we've always admired you. It's an honor to fight by your side. of two LCS ships. They're targeting our flagship. We need your assist. What machine is this? Dragon's Eye here. We've never seen this model before. Oh, ready. Dragon's Eye to Brock Obama. Where are the M5s? When will they arrive? System on Hardpoint 6 is ready. All enemy strike force will neutralize. Ready. Good job, everyone. The flagship is still there. Thank you very much, Lieutenant. We're in your tent. We did it! Say, I'm going to propose to my girlfriend where I get back. Lieutenant, we detect multiple crafts approaching. Prepare to engage. Everyone else except Lieutenant Juliana's squadron, please evacuate from combat area. Everyone listen! These guys are ace pilots. You have to fully concentrate on the dogfighting. Shot down. You'll freeze to death before the rescue chopper arrives. Ready to move, Black Knight 3. The enemy squadron comprises of three Bearcoods and one prototype battle frame. Kill the Bearcoods first. They're much weaker targets. Then we'll attack them. 
that violent machine all at once. Lieutenant, I beg you, bring those kids home alive. The Russian pilot's tougher than I thought. Keep paying attention to your surroundings. Don't let them gain you. If you focus and keep following only one battle frame, the other machine will flank and kill you. These guys are masters of squadron dogfighting tactics. Buddy, oh, I swear I've seen a battle frame with that kind of capability before. Enemy forces destroyed. Yes, sir. Combat mode disengaged. Hardpoint four reloaded and ready. Get to the enemy's flagship. We've marked it on your HUD. The overbooster won't last long. Make the most out of it while you can. The particle cannon is meant to be used as an anti-ship weapon, Colonel. Don't waste it in dogfights. You won't hit battle frame with it. Detecting heat signatures approaching at very high speed. Missiles, intercept them. All units be advised. The red machine is approaching the flagship at three times the speed of the others. What? Focus your fire on that machine. All the others are just decoys. Let's see. We've got three capital ships on this side. One cruiser and two destroyers. I'm going to sink them first. What do you need our reinforcement? The reinforcement will be two Kirov class destroyers with battle frame escort gun. Then they will deal with the escorting frigates and LCS. Negative, Colonel. Enemy ships are able to evade ion cannon. You'll have to sink those frigates after you're done with the three capital ships. What do you expect me to do all that in flight? You Yes, Colonel. Let's start by focusing on not giving yourself a human first. I don't want to have to give you post humans two rank promotion. Everyone knows I'll be Colonel forever, anyways. The Colonel is not fighting alone. Show him what we're made of. Take all of the enemy ships that are also equipped with an ion cannon before we arrive. Colonel, you can sink enemy LCS with only one shot of the particle cannon. Nah, I should have hit the head uh, back at the base. You know there's a toilet installed under your seat, right? Just enable the autopilot and use it. Uh, there's no time. Better to make a mess in my surf than get shot down. Well, the maintenance crew will have your head, buddy.
All surviving forces retreat to USAF Yukon base. I have a private military contractor to call. 